Okay, hello everybody. This is Mia. And what we're going to be doing is a lot of you have probably heard about the apple cider vinegar cleanse. Um, I got um, Simple Organic, and it you have to get the one that says with the mother on it. Otherwise, you're basically wasting your time. So, I'm going to show you how to make the apple cider vinegar cleanse drink. First, you have to do two, tables, two tablespoons of the apple cider vinegar cleanse. And then I have some lemon juice here, and you'll be doing two tablespoons of that. And then you're supposed to only do two tablespoons of the honey, but I do three, sometimes four. And so um, I'm going to be doing that. So that's one. And two. I'm doing this with one hand, so it might take a minute. And that's one of the lemon juice. And that's two. And then That's honey, because the honey is really sticky, so that's why I put a couple of them in there. Two. There we go. Okay, so now that I've done that. You're also going to make sure you put the cinnamon in there. So that's one tablespoon of cinnamon. And what we're going to do is we're going to make a tea. You're going to, um, what I do is I take two um, of these turmeric um, tea and I have a lot of different types of turmeric teas That's two. Now, some people, now, um, so this is how I do my turmeric um, apple cider vinegar um, cleanse drink. And I've been taking it so far for two weeks, and um, this really, it really does work. And what I do is I have a kick up machine. So to make the tea, I just, instead of, you'll see that there's nothing on top. So um, what I do is I just run it, make sure that the back has water in it, and then I just go ahead and run it, and it only water comes out, as you can see. And it turns it into tea. And I just really wanted um, you guys to really get the gist of exactly how much you want to water down the apple cider vinegar. Um, so um, if apple cider vinegar is also good for cleansing out your own body if you're trying to go alkaline. Um, if you're trying to cleanse out your body, then you probably want to do three tablespoons of it. 
um, I've heard um, if you're drinking it throughout the day, do three tablespoons. But if you're only going to drink it this one time um, before you eat anything for the day, then only do two tablespoons. Um, you don't want to do more than two tablespoons if you're going to be, um, if you're just drinking it like for right now, like I'm about to. Now, if I like, I actually work at a call center, work for home job. And um, what I do is um, because I know I'm going to be on the call center for like an hour, like all day. Then sometimes I do add three tablespoons to it. But that's only if I know that I'm going to be drinking on it for a while. Um, for the most part, I've done my research and it seems like two tablespoons is the safest route to go. So I'm just only going to recommend, I'm just going to leave that information right there. So as you can see, this is how much the K-Cup machine puts water in there. So this right here, I actually, I just filled this up with um, water, and um, cool water, and I'm mixing this with that. And that's how much I get it for. Yep, and this is kind of, yep, and so there we go. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to go ahead and check this now. Um, well, God bless you, and have a great day.